Zay Jones practiced for the first time since that frightening night in downtown LA in March, and the scars on his right knee were evident. Jones wouldn't comment directly on what happened and said he's just simply thankful to be alive. You know, I could have lost my life, so I'm grateful to just be here and to be on this field and to be with my teammates, to see my family. Um, I don't think there's any other word that describes it. The moment was very traumatic for me and my family, and to rehash that now at this point in time wouldn't be doing me any good. Sometimes you know, life's going to knock you down or things are not going to go the way that you planned or hoped, but you got to pick yourself up and you got to keep moving forward. Um, in no way do I, am I going to feel sorry for myself. We've moved forward. Well, we got our work cut out for us, and Zay knows that. Um, it's not something that can't be achieved. Um, we just got to continue to work. I haven't stayed the same or gone back to where I was. I've progressed and gotten better. As a person, as a human being, and as a football player. When asked if he would be ready for week one, Jones says he's not thinking that far ahead and simply said he's focusing on making sure his knee is ready for tomorrow's practice. With the Bills Report at St. John Fisher College, I'm Dan Fates.